Hi everyone. Today we are going to see how we can uh, save the S3 access logs into another bucket. So if you have one bucket and you want to list everything that's going on inside that bucket, if someone is accessing that, if someone is uploading something and someone is deleting something, if you want a list of logs for all that, you can uh, you can store that log in another bucket. So let's uh, try to do, do this. So we have this bucket, the UI guy static. And uh, I will create another bucket where we will store the logs. Okay. So let's create a bucket and let's call this uh, UI logs. Okay. So I will just uh, enable the bucket burgeoning also and create this bucket. Okay. So our uh, bucket is ready. Now I will go to the bucket uh, for which I want to enable the logs and I will go to the properties section. And if you scroll down, uh, we'll see this server accessing logging, which is disabled by default. And now I'll edit this and I will enable this. And now I have to browse the target bucket where I want to store all these logs. I'll browse this and I will select the UI guy logs. Okay, and I'll choose this path. And if you'll see now it is uh, sending, uh, showing me an uh, alert that bucket policy will be updated for the destination bucket okay because in this your destination bucket we need to store the logs so that bucket policy needs to be updated to store the logs to allow the put operation you can say as well now this uh, is enabled now let's try to do something here let's try to maybe access some files okay okay let's uh, maybe upload some files over here i'll upload some files add files and uh, Let's upload this one okay so we did some changes so if you'll go to this uh, another bucket to check the logs so the logs actually takes a quite amount amount of time like uh, uh, maybe around 15 minutes or half an hour to show up okay so in the meantime you can check the bucket polish as well as uh, if it's updated at bucket polish or not so if you'll uh, scroll down you can say that uh, just a second yeah here inside this uh, permission tab you can see this pocket policy is updated for the logging okay so it automated this by default uh, it uh, added the log uh, thing by default and we're not seeing this but it will come off in some time so that that's it for this video so our data will definitely come up